weather riding tips. I suppose now ain't a bad time to explain some, is it? Um, so, I suppose a couple of golden rules for wet weather riding. If you commute in the winter, you're going to need some decent rubber on the bottom of these wheels. You, you just cannot get away with having, you know, track day spec tyres um, for riding around in winter, in these kind of conditions anyway. So, yeah, definitely tyres, major, major factor. Um, also your gear, and I'm not one to speak at this particular point in time, because I'm in f***ing jeans which are soaked. And my jacket needs treating because it's not really waterproof anymore, it's just gone straight through it. My gloves aren't my waterproof ones. And it's solely because I just wanted to pick Daisy up today. Um, if you can't tell, I've recorded this at the same time as when I picked her up. So suck a dick! So yeah, your gear. Make sure your gear is waterproof. I've got waterproof boots on, um, if nothing else. <laughs> Because, you know, there's nothing like being comfortable when it's raining. You don't want to be how I am at the minute, where your fingers are starting to get a bit cold, uh, the tops of my forearms are cold, the tops of my legs are cold, all because the rain's got through. So, yeah, definitely tyres, gear, and then thirdly, keep your eyes on the road. And I don't just mean Oh, you know, like don't look at some hot chick walking past. I'm 通过监控录像，我们可以看到，在当天下午十五点五十六分许，一名驾驶员骑着辆轻便的摩托车在经过越江。So I mean, genuinely, you need to keep an eye down on that tarmac and at the car in front, or even the car in front of that. Just, I mean, look how many wet leaves there are around here at the minute. Um, my personal preference in the rain, which isn't what I was taught on my. Um, on my lessons, they tell you to stick in the middle of the road. Now, if um, actually, I was going to jump back to gear quickly because my visor is terrible. I should really pull over and clean it, but I've got nothing to clean it with. Um, the inside is just fogged up. The water's got inside, um, and I'm fucked. So that's another tip. Get something where you can consistently see out of like a pin lock or something. So um, yeah, if you're, if you're looking at the road, so I'm in the centre line now. And if you ever notice, again, I'm not too sure if it's the same principles abroad, it probably is. But specifically the UK, always, always, always the oil trails are in the middle. Now, I don't know about you. But from past experiences, I'm pretty sure oil is quite slippery in the wet. So my general rule of thumb is to stay in the tire line. Now this sucks because you're going to get a lot more spray, um, all of that kind of stuff. So, but it means all the you know like cars' tires they they drag shit off of the uh, of the road. So you've got all the wet leaves i mean look where they all gather they don't gather where the tires go do they they all tend to gather in the middle and that's kind of my rule i try and stick to a tire line and you know dependent on corner it'll be that side or this side um so I suppose it's that tip as well. Also, try and ride as if you're. Um... Thank you. In terms of body position, try and use your dry style of riding um, to ride in the wet. So if you're, if you've come up to a corner a bit fast, don't just panic and snatch a brake and try and, you know, slow down. You know, get a cheek off the seat. Like, get your shoulder in. Like. If you're going to come off, you're going to come off. You might as well try the correct positioning to get yourself out of it. If you watch any MotoGP in the wet, their, their style's very similar. They just don't go right onto the edge of the tyre. And obviously, none of us should be hanging it around on the roads in the wet. So, you know, try and, try and relax up. Don't tense, because that is just when you will crash, tensing up. 
the air. I'd definitely say um, you've got to leave your distances bigger, braking. Um, you can't just rip your throttle back because it just will not work. <laughs> I was saying that. In wet leaves. I hate them. Yeah. Um, other than that, really, I mean, there's not much more else to say. I mean, just with experience, you'll find what works better for yourself in terms of, um, you know, riding in the wet and everything. So, you know, just take it easy. Try not to be a hero. Leave yourself some space. Um, and most will be patient, which is not easy for bikers at all, because we feel like we've got to get somewhere all the time. So, um, yeah. Hope I could help someone with that info. <laughs> uh, well, hope the weather's better where you lot are. Ladies.